tell me, how much time and preparation have you spent before this competition? Maybe you know I'm in preparation from October 2014 because I uh, was in Sydney on March and then on World Championship in Malta in June. So this is my last competition this year and I, so I'm surprised what wonderful guys are here and what excellent audience is here. And thank, you. thank you all for coming and enjoy the rest of the night. Dave Tittenden, a pleasure to see you again. Uh, I've uh, known you for a long time now, and again, how much preparation have you put towards this show? Uh, I've probably been uh, dating for sort of 16 weeks, 17 weeks now. Um, my view was, with the standard that this was going to be this year, it, it, it required a longer preparation, if you know what I mean. I mean you can't bring your A-game here. Don't go. <laughs> it's a pleasure to see you again, thank you. I'll just come around the back. Number 85, Charles, from Brazil. How's your English? Good? <laughs> First of all, congratulations for next year you'll be holding the World Championships in Brazil. And do you get much um, chance of going around the areas in Brazil and doing your uh, star guest spots? <laughs> Thank you very much indeed. You're, you're in the Right, number 82, we have here Mike Sheridan, Daddy Kingdom. Hi, Mike, nice to see you again. That's yeah, What's your preparation for each and been like for the last few months? I've only 23 weeks. Uh, see you again. And number 81, Thomas Bionic from Austria. Thomas, how are you? Fine, thank you. Uh, Thomas, this is not the Eurovision contest, all right? <laughs> when, um, when do you actually go back to Austria? Tomorrow. Are there any more competitions? My last. This year. Yes. Will you vote? Next year, I come better. Anyway, you... Yeah, round of applause. Thomas has always been a credit to himself and uh, to Austria because he's competed in many competitions and in the world and Europe and so forth. Congratulations, it's been a good effort for tonight. Barney, good to see you. Um, that hairdresser of yours. <laughs> is it really? Is it? I really do you know it's fantastic out there, isn't it? <laughs> Barney, how are you keeping? Very well, thank you. With preparation, how far out have you had to work with it? I've been dancing since I became a vegan eight months ago. And, uh, I'm proud of these things. Good luck. Well done. Thank you, Michael. Well done, Andy Paul. Nice to see you again, man. How are you? <laughs> uh, roughly translated, he said he was very happy. <laughs> and number 76, Jay from Australia. You... No, I... yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, where have we got? Nicopolis. Nicolopolis. Yeah, all the way from Australia. Where else in Australia? I'm from Melbourne, Australia, thank you. Um, I tell you, you've come a hell of a journey to be here. And uh, almost 25 hours I've gone here to get here. And uh, I'm like uh, the young kid on the block again. This is my first pro show with all these old farts. So, uh, <laughs> <laughs> but, um, you know, this is an awesome experience for me. That's why I just wanted to get up on stage. And uh, this is like starting as a junior again, or starting from the bottom. Working my way back up, so I'm just really happy to be up here with uh, these guys that I've been watching, you know, for a long time. I've been competing with David WFF since I was 18 years old. So it's uh, one of my first WFF Mr. Universe when I was uh, 19 in Germany, and I've stayed with David WFF and the whole family for all these years. Well, uh, it's a pleasure to have met you. Nice to meet you, Tony Matt. 